Okay, guys, so you might have seen by the title and thumbnail. Uh, so basically, what I think is basically the girl tag pride jam update is kind of very controversial because, and I don't mean anything like, I don't mean anything to the pride community. Uh, I don't, it's my opinion, what I think, but I don't really like this update. They put way more effort into this update. As I can show you, they painted the walls rainbow. They added that, that, that. But in normal updates, or like flashbacks, we barely get anything except for the winter update. They put way too much effort into this update. And also, the he, she, and they badges. Why do we need them? Like, no, I don't know. And plus, there's these people, and they're calling these the, the gay pride people different names. Like, they're calling them gay whatever. You know what word I'm talking about. Yeah, and there's like seven, six, eight-year-olds in the game hearing that. And then... When they go to school, they're going to tell their friends all these new words that they learned. Then they're just going to start using it on people. And one day they're just going to get hurt for it. So yeah, I don't think it was a good idea to add the pride update. But the only... The... These... Water... The courses are... I mean, they're good, but they put way too much effort. Like, all the wood is rainbow for Pride Update. The cosmetics, they put way too much, um, thing. Like, it's so crazy that they put this much up, this much work into a Pride Update. So, yeah, I just wanted to talk about it. And I hopefully, I didn't, for any people that are a part of the Pride community or that support it, I don't hurt, I hope I didn't hurt your feelings, so, yeah. I'll see you in the next video.